Today's a bit of a different day. My Nana and my Papa are in town, my, uh, my aunt, my uncle, Mike and Emma, and my little cousin Ada are gonna be here as well shortly. My girlfriend Sarah is gonna be here as well. This whole group of us are about to go down to Seattle to go on a different kind of trip. You've seen me go to the Caribbean. Went to California with a bunch of them like last year, last year, last year. Hey, Meg! <laughs> this time around, we're going to Seattle and we're going on a boat. Not any kind of boat, but a massive cruise ship. <laughs> We're about to set sail on a seven day trip to Alaska to celebrate my grandparents' 50th wedding anniversary. Huge milestone. What better way to celebrate than to bring everyone out to the West Coast and see Alaska in its raw beauty. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> This is amazing. This is This ridiculous. is the best thing ever. I gotta stop recording now because I'm at the border. We're starting off our Alaskan vacation with the fine culinary arts of McDonald's. Or as my dad says, McChoke and Duke. Yeah. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Fancy with the Touch it. Touch it. Is it a microphone? Yeah. <laughs> is, that, is that The moment has finally come. Getting on the boat. It's been a, well, how long in the making? A lot of days. It's a few it days. It was 160 something days when we first planned the trip. So that is oddly precise. Yeah. We're on. I think that'll do just fine. Yeah, this is $6? Yeah. Top party! Yeah. Top, top, top party! You can go up to the buffet and get ice cream. Party! Top party! Top party! After so long, finally managed to get a meal here. The buffet literally has everything. I got like, I got loin, pizza, burger, fries, pasta. Sarah. Miss, I'm gonna eat healthy. Yeah. Got that. <laughs> a plate of brown. No, no regrets, right? No regrets. The view from the girls' room right now has a beautiful view downtown Seattle, including the lovely Space Needle. And you look above, there's the water slide <laughs> directly above the room. So what? other way to celebrate the first night of a cruise than with the dinner for two dinner. at a French restaurant, Le Bistro. Very excited. Her first cruise, my first time going to this restaurant, heard nothing but good things about it. A plus 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 so far. <laughs> I'm, I'm excited. Mm -hmm. 
I don't think I've ever been somewhere so fancy in my life. This is ridiculous. I love this. So the first of our appetizers are here, and wow, I got two because I can. I got the mussels, and oh my gosh, those look delicious. Sarah got the crab salad. It's very interesting. Cut that open. Outside knife. Close enough. <laughs> Oh man, that looks good. Just filled to the brim with crab. I don't think I've ever eaten mussels that fast in my entire life. Yeah. Delicious. Now this looks incredible. The cheese. Oh, the cheese. Oh, the cheese. Mm. Oh my. That is like heartwarming. <laughs> That's heartwarming. The picture prices. Those look incredible. I don't think it gets much better than this. A spectacular view, right by your table, with what was probably one of the best pizza, pieces of meat I've ever eaten in my entire life. I thought you were going to say pizza. I was like, oh, nice. <laughs> I'm not that dumb. <laughs> Cecile Badil, apple tartan with an ice cream, and of course, <laughs> the creme brulee. Sarah, do the honors. you got to break it. Oh, yeah. I love how I'm That's rude. well made. <laughs> First night eating, I think it was a huge success. I don't think I've ever had a full complete meal that was that good in my entire life. Incredible. Welcome to day two. with the view like this doesn't get much better than that absolutely stunning so because this boat is so freaking massive we thought we'd take some time just to explore and see what's all around here we're in the atrium Even comes with a Starbucks. We're coming up now to 678 Ocean Place, and this is absolutely gorgeous. Unfortunately, a few weeks back, I fractured my ankle. So, do we have one more deck to go? Because of that, 
I gotta get some of the strength back in my ankle, so we're going to the gym. Get our gains on. It's actually the first time in my entire life I've been in a gym on a cruise ship. That's not the true definition of adulting, I don't know what is. After we just had a completely filling dinner, what better way to wrap it off than to go to the place that's known for monstrosities of desserts, Coco's. I think it's safe to say we absolutely crushed that. Yeah, I'm having problems. <laughs> How's your shake, Brian? Yeah, I'm doing this solo. <laughs> Absolutely breathtaking. So calm. Oh, there's something right there. for miles. This weather is absolutely spot on. You couldn't ask for better weather. This is phenomenal. Absolutely gorgeous. This is so weird. I never thought I'd need just a t-shirt and shorts in Alaska. This is absolutely beautiful out here. This is Sarah Queen's vlog channel now. Eric Kinkratz is Take over Tuesday. Take over Tuesday. Isn't it like the weirdest feeling knowing that some big underwater creatures like could be like right under you? You just don't know where it is. <laughs> now it's a game of hide and seek.
Now that was a once in a lifetime experience. And I probably won't forget for a while. Absolutely incredible. Magnificent creatures. So, so cool to be able to be that close to them. So when we came here, like years ago, I remember coming to this spot right here. You can just smell it outside. Oh man, that's insane. Pretty successful day in Drew. Stop one of four complete. Day, day four is upon us. We're in Skagway, Alaska today, and we're gonna go on a little adventure. We're going on the White Pass Scenic Railway. It's a train line that goes like by the mountains and the water. I think it even goes into Canada. Super excited for that. We booked that literally this morning. Hi. Hi. So yeah, I'm super excited for it. How do I do that? It's already trying to record it. Just shoot it. Coming back into town in style. Literally in the middle of the road. <laughs> Sorry. Park, and I don't think we could have had a better, better day of weather for it. Beautiful. Sarah's all bundled up in a blanket. Oh yes, it's freezing. <laughs>
absolutely mind-blowing. This is nuts. What better way to celebrate the fact that we're here than with a little bit of a chilled champagne, eh, Mom? Mm -hmm. Cheers. Uh, Cheers. Welcome to our last port city in Alaska, Ketchikan. I honestly think that if I were to live in any Alaskan city, it would probably be Ketchikan. A lot of things here, scenery is still gorgeous, like it's, I think it's a very livable city. How dare you. Hi, Brian, you taking over now? No. Oh. Takeover Thursday. Except it's not Thursday. Yes it is. No it's not. Takeover Friday. There we go. That's a big fish. Oh, there we go. That's a Let's nice see dog guy. Oh, well, get that. Grab him by the tail. Right now. Get the things. Oh, big fish. Watch the hook. Okay. Now they're taking a picture of it. That's a nice one. Get that lid. Help it. Okay, right Come on, here. give it a kiss. Give it a kiss. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> Thank you so much, that's delicious. Thank you very much. Do you want to send this? I have a sneaking suspicion Alaska is famous for their salmon. Just a hunch. So as we approach our cruise ship for the last time leaving Alaska, babe, thoughts on Alaska? So pretty, but it's so sad to leave. The vacation went so fast. It's very sad. Alaska, absolutely gorgeous. The landscape is unlike anything I've ever seen before. The people are so nice. The salmon and the food are incredible. So good. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna miss this place. Me too. with a view. Taking a little wander outside into the waterfront. Waterfront, water what the? Oh, whoops. <laughs> <laughs> that didn't happen. <laughs> oh man, that's funny. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, this water is so calm. You can hear the DJ up on the pool deck. Mambo number five. Is it actually? Yeah. <laughs> Hi. 
Hey babe, I think I see something. I see a whole lot of water. Really? Yeah. I'm in complete disbelief as to how calm the water is. Like the only thing that way is maybe Hawaii. <laughs> and it's so calm. Absolutely oh, ridiculous. Cold. It's not cold. It is not cold. I am shivering. It is not cold. It is cold. Babe, why do we have to go back to society tomorrow? Why? I don't know. It's very sad. So, so sad. We made a really big mistake. We found our favorite bar on the last day of the cruise. This is absolutely delicious. The fact that we found it on the last day makes me really sad. Oh, we, we screwed up. We screwed up. Our last, what are you doing? She gone. Just docked in Victoria. We're here for a grand total of like three and a half hours, not even. Us and all this are trying to get off at once. Welcome back to the motherland, Canada. So literally the only point of us getting off the boat today because we're only here for such a short period of time and we've both been to Victoria before is I just want to get some photos of the front of the boat. Because I haven't done that yet at all this trip. <laughs> Victoria? Oh, Kinda, yeah. Not really. That 30 minutes is awesome. <laughs> it's like I've never been here before, you know? I know, right? It's it's just, I'm experiencing so many new things. It's not like we're an hour and a half air right away or anything, because we're totally not. No, I, it's more like a day, you know? Yeah, exactly. It's so far away. We gotta take an entire cruise ship to, to and I don't. Yeah, and I don't know any family here either. <laughs> so, you know, it's just, it makes it even like, more tourists. It makes it more of a hassle to get here. It yeah. makes it all the more worthwhile. Oh yeah. Huh. It's really sad because back on the boat now after a really quick stint in Victoria and I packed up all my bags and it's all outside waiting to get picked up to be picked up on the pier tomorrow. This week went by so fast. I'm really sad now. It's all over. But not quite. Because tonight, while we are still docked in Victoria for a little bit, there's something that I've always wanted to check out. It's a silent disco. So let's see how this goes. It's so weird to take them off and it's like it's just a quiet room. But everyone's listening to music on this. This is the coolest thing. That's all she wrote. But no vacation is complete until one last stop at the buffet for breakfast. <laughs> Ain't that right? Yum. Coffee. <laughs> Happy, happy, smelly, smelly, coffee, coffee. <laughs> Alright, it's done. 
Why am I so sad now, dang it? Uh, whatever. It'll... I'll come on another cruise, I'm pretty sure. Sooner rather than later. Hopefully. I'm impatient. It is officially over. <laughs>